Hello, hello, dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus and everyone watching this program. Welcome back, welcome back. I'm very much excited today because I'm announcing we're gonna start today a uh, live discussing uh, from uh, using YouTube and Skype. Uh, and we'll discuss about uh, this topic. Uh, one moment. Dismantling the lies and deceptions of Muslims and Muslim agents. My Skype account is Amos21. That is A M O S Z21. That's my Skype account. And you can call and ask a question. But before that, please. Uh, discuss with this uh, uh, topic. The topic is uh, with this uh, Bart Ehrman, one of uh, the famous Bible theologian and now uh, 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 agnostic, or rather he's a Muslim, he's a Muslim agent. Please listen and discuss about this point. Bart Ehrman, welcome back to Fresh Air. In your book, Jesus Interrupted, you compare the Gospels and discrepancies from one Gospel to another in everything from factoids to what Jesus said before he died. Why is it important to consider these discrepancies? I think it's important to know that each of these authors of the New Testament had a different message. What, what people tend to do is, uh, is uh, allied the various teachings of, say, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, so that if Matthew portrays Jesus in one way and Mark portrays him in a different way, what people do is they conflate the two accounts so that Jesus says and does everything that he says in Matthew and in Mark. But when, but when you do that, you, in fact, rob each of these authors of their own integrity as an author. When Matthew was writing, he didn't intend for somebody to read some other gospel and interpret his gospel in light of what some other author said. He had his own message. And so uh, recognizing that there are these discrepancies is a, is a kind of a, a key to the interpretation of these books because it shows that they each have a different message and that you can't uh, that you can't smash the four gospels into one big gospel and think that you get the get the true understanding so what is the problem now in, in, the, in your discussion bring a Bible uh, verses and supporting idea from the Bible and find out what is the problem with his teaching his way of understanding the gospel did he understand the Bible the, the Bible well for himself or he doesn't if he doesn't why if he's, he, he, if he understood it, uh, how? Please give your discussion. We are going to discuss on this topic in today's program. Uh, uh, please uh, discuss on the, on the topic. Uh, so uh, if you have any question also, you, uh, you will have a time to call on Skype and discuss uh, or ask a question or answer uh, uh, or, or, or submit your uh, opinion also. You share your opinion and uh, the, the future also, how we handle such issues. So today is this, this people. These are some of the people we are going to uh, handle. So don't be scared because of they have great name. Don't be scared. One who is in us is much greater than the whole world. Christ Jesus, the hope of glory. We will debunk them and we'll show them that they are liar, uh, liars and deceivers. Until we, uh, the program starts after four, about uh, four or three, three some hours. Uh, and uh, until then, may the Lord richly bless you. Bye-bye. See you soon.